Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Margaret, also known as Seven Plaza. And today is day 74 of the 100 day project. What I want to do today is some scrap busting. I have all sorts of scraps like everywhere in my craft room. Um, and I'd like to make some clusters today. I want to make clusters that you can also have as tuck spots in junk journals. So let's get started. Let me show you what sort of things I want to use today. These are like um, price tags from clothing companies. I have some, um, what's this, calling cards or business cards. And most of them are like really sturdy. Uh, I could make them into tags, but what I want to do is use them as a base for these clusters. I have some old buttons, some of these chipboards, I don't know, decorations. I have some cigar bands, some vintage uh, advertisements. I have these doilies printed out. Let's just use them. A piece of uh, vintage papers from 1956. Uh, yeah, it's French and written on. Why not use it? I have tickets and, you know, my boxes of scrap thingies. So, and of course, scissors and glue and such oh i also have this jar of goodies so that's what we're going to use um let's get started i first want to cover these like bases with some like background paper like for instance this paper and some scraps to make them disappear for a bit and then on top of that i'll make some sort of clustery type of collage stuff i don't know something like that so First, let's do some basic covering with, you know, papers that I have in abundance everywhere. <laughs> I'm just pulling some stuff out. Great. Let's start with this one. This was a bridal company, if I'm not mistaken, because that's my day job. I've been in bridal fashion for ever <laughs> forever let's just say forever Good. so these are great to have like in a box on the side when you make journals and decide to have you know make a talk spot and make it a little bit more interesting like um have it in a theme or something you're again gluing on your mat, love. Yeah, that's what makes them sticky. This is telephone book page. <laughs> I just enjoy that. People are like, really telephone book page. That's your pleasure. Yep, that's my pleasure. Let's have a glue book, yeah? There you go. Guys, I have an intro. What do you think? I am by no means like a professional filmer or editor of what or whatever. Uh, but I was like, maybe, maybe you should have like a nice intro. I don't know. Well, that's one. Let's just, let's just do some mass making. So I was, you know, fiddling about yesterday on, um, whatchamacallit, um, Canva. That's actually a pretty good place to go if you um, want to make something for your YouTube channel or you know a project i use it all the time it is a free website you could also sign up and have like uh, much more uh, content on there you can do a lot of things then shall we have the doily mm, i want the doily to stick out a bit yes more of this paper yeah again there's a glue book here there's a glue book here and I'm gluing here. Yeah, so smart. Sometimes this woman is so very smart. Yeah, that's what I keep telling myself. Normally I would cut it off, but I want it to stick out. This is like the first part of the cluster. I don't know if you can call this a cluster because most of the time the clusters are made um, just getting stuff together, holding it and then clipping it with a um, tiny attacher or Glue. I'm just going to make a sort of a collage thingy on here. That's what I like. Let's do three, yeah? Good. What do I have here? Oh, this is actually a washi sticker bit. Yeah. 
I believe so. Yeah. So now it goes on here. Let's have it flip over. What else do I have in the department of scrappy scraps? That's not a lot. Let's have some more. I have this box filled with goodies. Let's actually. Oh, let's have a strip. Sure, sure. This is old German Gothic font. Yeah, love to use up my scraps because I keep making new scraps with every project that I make. So maybe it's a good thing to get rid of some. This is more decorative style. Oops, yeah. Also, I think this is a scrap. was like from a paper bag I guess something like that and then I need a piece in the middle what piece do we need more doily sure I'm going to have more doily on but there's a lot of white on here so let's see if I can quickly make the white disappear yeah no more white Okie dokie. Well, we have our three bases now. Not these ones, no, not the small ones. We're going for the bigger ones. This one, we have this one, and we have this one. Okay, now for some decorating. Let's pick out a focal point. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. Um, I'm thinking today is a butterfly day. Yes, today is a butterfly day. Why not have a butterfly on here? I have loads. Um, I'm not going to do the washi sticker ones. No, I'm just going to do the paper ones. So I have all of these. These are more like moths than butterflies, but I like them anyway. Shall we do the big one first? No, let's just keep the big one for last. I want to have a butterfly on here. This one. And then I also want to have oh, you know, some of this underneath. I'd like to use this piece somewhere. Maybe a cigar band. I have cigar bands here. Like a more neutral one. A button. Yes, let's have a button. Big one. Well, why not? Let's have a big button. I'm just going to move stuff about to see what fits um what else do i have tickets i have tickets i took off all i took out all my bits <laughs> oh there's an orangey one here yeah i think that is nice i don't need the whole bit just part of it will do can we have this underneath here yes i also want to add some of these labels that i made these are some handmade labels <clears throat> well, handmade. You know, I have a printer that prints them for me. Oh yeah, it's gonna have. I already love it. Don't know about you guys, but I already love it. I have um, cheese. Um, yeah, this is uh, gauze that I coffee dyed. So we could have some underneath somewhere. I like that effect. I hardly ever use that, but you know. Let's have some scissors to cut it. This doesn't want to be ripped. Well, neither does my body. <laughs> I am not ripped. No. This could also be nice just underneath the whole bit here. See? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> this is not my usual style uh, because it's all a bit everywhere basically uh, but I do like it and I want to get outside of my comfort zone though. so that's why I'm trying new stuff new things just another piece of paper sort of over here and also let's see if I can find some uh, thread or something that goes well with this I have some brown like Avril yarn bits that could work or I have this 
Oh yeah, I think this will work even better. Yeah, no idea how I am going to attach it, but I think that'll work. What do you think, guys? Yeah. Well, um, I'm going to attach it here and there. I am going to start with the cars underneath. And to picture how it was. So this is not how you're supposed to make closet. You're supposed to like keep it all together and then attach it. I believe so. I don't know. I Do I look like a, cl a cluster expert? I am basically not. I am not. Maybe I will be someday. I just scrunch it a little bit. And I thought that this ticket was going to go over here. Yes. Well, we're getting there. And I'll have this piece. It's really fun to do though. I love this. Very relaxing. Let's see, I wanted to have the butterfly over here and then this to go underneath. Or maybe a little bit underneath. Yeah. This straight piece first. This was already on, yeah? Okay. Glue book again. Oh, my desk is so small. Maybe you should remove some stuff off your desk. I could do that, but it's also very lovely to look at. So, this is sticking out like so. Maybe the cigar band also sticking out. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it. I wanted to add another piece of paper, sort of over here. What to do with the with the uh, yarn? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Don't know yet. Don't know yet. But I want to. I want to attach it somewhere. Underneath the butterfly. Yeah, sure, sure. How am I going to do that? Well, uh, art, art. think that will work and besides we're gonna glue the butterfly atop of it so that will also make it stick right yeah I think so yeah but we were going to have this one sort of stuck underneath the mind frame could look yeah short sure. sort of Yep. Okay. Yeah, we were also doing the, the, the button, right? Yeah. Over here. Well, I need drippy for this. And then there's all this space over here. I don't like that. Um, so... A number. <laughs> of course, we're gonna do a number. A bigger number. Maybe a bigger number. Yes, bigger number. Yep. Trying to glue with the cap on. So smart, this woman. So, so very smart. Yes. Let me get Drippy. Have no fear. Drippy is here. So it is a warming up as we speak. That That's very quick because it's like 20 seconds. Also had another idea. I have all these like vintage uh, pins. I have a gazillion. And I was thinking maybe we could like put it somewhere underneath. Oh yes. I love that. That is really cool. Let's see, I am not going to put a bow or something through this button. I'm just basically, ow, I'm going to burn my hands first because, you know, that's a good thing to do. Um, put it on here. Yeah. This is a bit flimsy. It's a bit flimsy. So I'm going to, need. I need to, this will not hold. 
but uh, this will. <laughs> I'm just gonna put the other part here. Yeah. Love it! Yeah, let's make another one. Okay, I have another small one. Let's get another doily out. Because why not still? It's a bit too wide for me. <clears throat> Trying to grunge it up a little bit. Like so. Yeah, good. Perfect. Oops, there you go. <clears throat> what I want to do, hopefully, soon, is make an altered altered paper clip video but uh i am i've been waiting for well, almost two months now for my uncle ali to bring me my ordered jumbo paper clips because i want to make big ones <coughs> let's see another butterfly I, I guess so i guess so maybe a smaller one let's keep the bigger ones Oh, this is a beautiful. No, this one. What? What are you doing, Margaret? You're like blah 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 blah. Yes, I am. I am. More scraps. Also like these these bits, but I don't know how I'm going to attach those. Um, I have some old advertisement. Oh, it says cigars. Yeah. Oh, it's the same dude. Look at that. No, I am. I'm not even joking. Look at that. It's the same dude, right? I believe so. Okay, so let's have this over here. I'm going to rip this off a bit. Oh, just, you know, you have fingers. You can do it like so. I didn't even know that that was the same. Same dude. Glue. Are you gluing it on straight away? Well, apparently I am. <laughs> um, num, num, num. Have this over here and this over here. I, I did like the straight bit, the longer bit. Do I have another piece that is longer? I have this, but this is a uh, sticker. So that's not going to work. Uh, what else do I have? A longer piece of this? Sure. You should have stuck this underneath Carol. That says Carol. It's, uh, it's the name of the dude. The dude's name. Still, I'm going to have it on. I'm going to have it on. There you go. Butterfly and this. Um, let's do a label. Because, you know, labels. Something small and brown. Don't think about it. Just pick this one. Just pick this one up. Yeah. I'm gonna... Oh, I had my own labels. Where are they? Oh, they're here. They are here. Um, let's see. If I have something that would look nice. Something in red. I can do red because um, there's red on here. Oh. Let's have this on here. No? Okay. Well then, no. Or not a square, because there's a square here. Let's do a square here. Yeah, I'm not going to think about it. I'm going to put it on. There we go. Still want the cattle do to be on here. Not this one. Yeah, this. No. Over here then. Yeah. I 
I'm still getting used to my new uh, camera setup. And I haven't heard from you guys if you like, if you see the difference, if you like this setup or the previous one. This will probably again lose its integrity, so I probably need to cut this off. Or I have it rest on here. I'll have it rest on here, on this bit. For some support. See? That works. I also want a button. Do you want a red one? Smaller one? With something underneath? Like... Um, cheesecloth. I forgot about the cheesecloth. Or maybe this vellum. This is um, spiderweb vellum. Oh yeah, that works. That works. I am going to ink the butterfly up. Yeah. Putting the butterfly down. vellum hoping hoping this will stick because vellum and glue basically not a very good combination but it's on there it is oh we're not gonna use that one some more paper let's have some glassine on vellum why not? Why not have some glass glassine on film? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. There you go. And then this bit. And I also want some thread. Let me get some that I like. Yeah. I do not know how I'm going to attach it, but it'll work out it'll work out because i probably will use drip before this and i'll have this underneath i will try i will try putting grippy on again i never do it like this normally i put the glue on the on the piece that i want to glue down but in this case, I think this will work better. Well, let's hope so. Oops. And then quickly the button. And then the button. Well, uh, sort of worked. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Let's see. Do we want anything else? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. No. We have one more to go. Where is it? Oh, here. It's here. Let's do this one. Right, so the left one. I don't know if I want doily to be up there or down here. I have no idea. I do want some uh, coffee dyed gauze on this. You can also have cheesecloth. I find cheesecloth to be very expensive. And this is like... From a first aid kit, like you have the package with, it's called gauze, I believe. And then you just coffee dye it. So I think I want to have this on here. Oops. Like so. Scrunching it up a bit. Still don't know which way, which way we are going to go. Let's just see. I do want this butterfly to be on there because that's sort of the theme. Let's have some butterflies. And what else? Um, tickets. That'd be nice. I'd like to have a big button. Oh, I also have this cigar band. And we have like a brown one, a nice brown one. Don't know. Um, I have cigar bands. Yeah, a whole bunch. 
have a, with a bird. Do not have something with a bird on Lovey because you already have a butterfly. What is this? Don't know. Don't know. It's brown though. Or this. Lots of brown ones. Is that the same? No, those more. More purpley ones. Maybe one of those. Maybe one of those. I like this. I actually like this. Um, let's have another pin on here. This. I don't even know what this is. But who cares? It's cute, right? Button. Brown one. Or this one. Yep. I like this. I really love this paper to be on here. What else do we have? Uh, another of these tickets, maybe. Sure. Want to have this on here. Like some sort of a stamp idea. Oh, this says airmail. Mm -hmm. That's not airmail. Like a leaf. I have this. All sorts of colors, maybe it's a bit much. Oh, let's have some sort of lace on here. Yeah, I have a box that has some lace scraps. Oh, this with the gold. Oh, that could be nice. That could be nice. I'm not gonna use all of it because that's way too big a piece. And this is too white, so I'm going to take my and try to distress it a little bit have it less white and more brownish if you want to see what I'm doing I'm just doing this having the leftover ink that is on here see it's no longer white uh, this needs to be underneath all of it I guess Still too big, still too big. It's a little bit too big. I'm not very good with lace. I sometimes see, well, I, all, all um, Tina does this all the time. She uses lace all the time. And I'm like, oh, that's so pretty. And then I get my laces out and I'm uh, like, what am I going to do with this exactly? What is it that you want to achieve? <laughs> well, apparently I want to achieve this. I'm just going to stick uh, some stuff down because otherwise this will take hours. There you go. Then I would like to have the ticket sticking out over here. Yes. Like so. Do you want to pin underneath? Where's the butterfly? Are we using this one? No, I had a big orangey one. Yes. It's a bit of ink. Needs a bit of ink, like I am tattooing the butterfly. <laughs> Um, let's see, have this underneath here. No, that's just too plain. This could work. Or have it straight here. No, 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 no. Or here. Yeah. Cigar bands. Never smoked a cigar in my life. Not even a cigarette. I am such a good girl. I don't smoke and I don't drink. I do love my McDonald's. <laughs> yep. And this one's going to go down here. Maybe with this underneath. We need to have something more red because of this bit, right? I also have some more red. Oh, maybe I have, um, how about a red stamp? Oh, these are words. 
Moonlight. No, no. I have stamps. Where do I have my stamps? I have them in a small box over here. This is red. Yeah. Yes. First do the stamp. That's on funny paper. It's not really stamp stamp paper. First this one, then the printed label. Oh, glue everywhere, love glue everywhere. Over here. Shall we do the butterfly? Yeah, let's do the butterfly. So yeah, I made my intro and then I was telling, you know, if you like paper crafting and vintage uh, ephemera and such, and it felt a little bit scripted. I'm sorry, that's, that's basically not me. I don't do things scripted, but I was really struggling with the, with the intro. So if you're like, who is this girl? We don't know her. Pretend we don't know her. No, that's another cigar band. So yeah, um, oh, I like this. So I was a bit struggling with the intro, but I thought it needed, I needed an intro. I needed it. Little piece of this underneath. No, no, I'm going to use it like this. So yeah, and then I told you guys that I wanted to do like whole videos and some more informative ones. And you just have to be patient for a little while longer because they don't fit in the in the 100 day project in my opinion i mean having a haul is not a project it's a fun thing to do it's really fun yeah i wanted this here it, it just it was a little bit you know it was missing a bit over there turning on drippy oh i like this um i've been struggling to use these because, you know, there they stick, because they're pins, and oh, when will you use them? But if you stick them in like this, uh, no, one will, no one will get hurt, so that's a good thing. Let's see, I need some glue on here. The glue comes through like the holes <laughs> and it's burning my fingers. Yes, that's not nice. <laughs> and uh, oh, all the glue threads. I'm rubbish with a glue gun. And this gun is, glue gun is very easy, I must say. I had worse. I had worse. Right. I think we're done. Here they are. Um, this was the one that we made first. I love it. They are all in a similar sort of style, um, but that's okay. I like them anyway. You can use them. Uh, I believe I will use these in like a fall themed um, journal because I really love the colors. Look, you can also remove this. I just, just noticed. <laughs> Love them. And then this one with the cigar dude on it. Yeah. Really cool. And then the big one. Again, you can probably, yeah, remove this. I really like this effect. I've been struggling how to use these. And this is actually like a perfect spot. Let me show you guys how I would use these. Um, taking out my, my journal. And having a blank page. I would have this as a tuck spot over here. I would glue it on this side and on this side. And then you could like add a tag to it or whatever you wish. Yeah. So that's it for today, guys. I hope you liked it. I really enjoyed the process of making these. I do not know if you can call these tuck spots uh, um, clusters. But I'm going to call them cluster tuck spots. <laughs> Why not? 
Uh, ladies, if you have not subscribed yet and liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And we'll be back again tomorrow with number 75. So that's another milestone. We're almost there. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.